please let me explain this again for those of you who were not very clear what I explained in class. So BPM is bit per minute, which means uh, the amount of the unit bit in a minute, which means 60 seconds. So if your BPM is 60, you have a 60 of that unit in 60 seconds meaning that your the duration of each unit bit will be one second so so if your duration is one second your bpm would be 60 because you have a 60 seconds in one minute and your duration of the each unit would be 60 over BPM and as I explained in the previous lecture uh, BPM uh, is the frequency and then duration can be understood as the concept of a period so let's assume if your duration is uh, like a half second then what would be your BPM so here if your duration is half second your BPM would be 120 and if your BPM is 60 your duration is one second which is I already mentioned so let's assume our quarter note uh, is 80 this means we have a 80 quarter note uh, in 60 seconds so uh, the duration of the quarter note would be 60 over 80 is uh, 3 over 4 seconds and when our uh, BPM and the quarter note is 80 what would be the BPM of uh, for example dotted quarter note or eighth note so here is our question And there are two ways to calculate this thing. So first of all, uh, one way is you have to calculate the duration of quarter note, which is uh, 3 over 4 seconds. So the duration of a uh, dotted quarter note would be 3 over 4 multiplied by 3 over 2, right? And then the duration would be 9 over 8. So your BPM would be uh, 60 over 9 over 8 right and if I calculate this is a 53.3333 da 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 and then the duration of uh, this one uh, eighth note would be 3 over 4 which is the uh, duration of the quarter note and then it's the half so the duration would be uh, 3 over 8 seconds and the BPM would be 60 over uh, 3 over 8 and it will become what is that 60 multiplied by is a 160 so this is one way by calculating the duration of the unit 60 divided by the duration would be the BPM of that unit Another way is that as we know BPM and duration is a reciprocal meaning that uh, if BPM increase the duration will decrease so we know that quarter note to dotted quarter note uh, would be the duration is uh, 3 over 2 right so if the BPM of this would be 80 then the BPM of dotted quarter note would be 80 multiplied by uh, 2 over 3 because BPM and duration is reciprocal so what we get BPM would be 53.3333 da 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 
uh, with the same uh, process, the duration from quarter note to eighth note would be uh, halved, right? So BPM would be doubled. So 80 to 160 would be the BPM of eighth note. So that would be the BPM calculation. And here is the, our question of uh, metric modulation. So our quarter note was 80. And at some point, uh, the previous dotted eighth note would be our new uh, quarter note. So how you conduct would be da ga 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 da da ga da da ga da da ga da. So we we can see the BPM is increased and the duration of eighth note is decreased because uh, it became like a three over four of the previous quarter note duration. So uh, as I said, there are two ways for you to calculate this, right? You have to calculate the duration of this thing, uh, which is a three over four second. And then duration of dotted eighth note would be three over four multiplied by uh, three over four is a, it becomes like a nine over uh, 16. So uh, the BPM would be 60 divided by 9 uh, over 16. So if you calculate this, uh, your 60 multiplied by 16 divided by 9 would be 106. 0.6666, so 106.7, something like that. Another way for you to calculate the uh, BPM of the new quarter note, which was the duration of the previous dotted eighth note, would be because your duration was uh, uh, became 3 over 4, your BPM would become like a 4 over 3. So your new BPM would be 80 multiplied by uh, 4 over 3 because duration and BPM are reciprocal. So 80 multiplied 4 over 3 is uh, same. So this is how you calculate the metric modulation and then new quarter note BPM would be 106.7 uh, let's say like that. So let's check if we are correct. So your 80 uh, quarter note is 80 is something like uh, like this. So let's check if 106 is something similar to that. So that's how you calculate the metric modulation BPM uh, values and you conduct those.